Hello everyone. In this tutorial, I'll show you two different methods for using a VPN on your PlayStation. Setting up a VPN on your PlayStation is not as easy as on your computer or mobile device, but I can help you with that today. Okay, so how do you install a VPN on your PlayStation? Well, there is no way to install it directly, so we will need to find some workaround. Right? Here are two different methods for using a VPN on your PlayStation. Method 1. Install a VPN on your router. If your gaming console doesn't have a VPN app, you can still use a VPN by installing it on your home router and connecting your gaming console to that router. This will have the same effect as using a VPN app on your gaming console, and it will also enable you to use a VPN on other devices that are connected to your home network. The problem with this method is that not every router supports a VPN, and not every VPN supports a router setup. So, if you decide to go with this method, you will need to do a little research and cross-reference the information that you find out. It is not as complicated as it sounds. We made a video dedicated to this kind of trouble, and it is linked in the description and comment section below. It is pretty detailed, so you shouldn't have too much trouble. Once you have mastered the part of installing a VPN on your router, the second part is pretty easy. You just need to connect your PlayStation to the router and that's it. The problem with this method is that it is really complicated to change VPN servers and all of your devices connected to that router go through a VPN even if you don't want to. So, this method works pretty well with the PlayStation, but it is not perfect. Let's move on to method number two, sharing a VPN connection from your Windows device. This method requires you to have a computer with a VPN already installed and connected. Unfortunately, Mac OS users will have to sit this one out as the Apple system just doesn't have an option for this. The benefits of this method are clear. It's pretty easy to set up and incredibly simple to tweak later on when you're trying to change VPN servers or make other adjustments. So, how do you set up a VPN hotspot? In this tutorial, I'll be using ExpressVPN. If you want to find out more about ExpressVPN, check out our full review linked in the description and comments section. Here are the steps you need to take when sharing a VPN connection from your Windows device. The first step is to open Network and Internet Settings on your computer. Once you're there, click on Mobile Hotspot and toggle the switch at the top to enable it. Underneath these options, press Edit to set a name and password for your VPN hotspot. For example, let's say we set the name to ExpressVPN since we're using that for this tutorial. Make sure to create a strong password that includes numbers, letters, and various symbols. After setting up the name and password, click Save. Now, let's go back to Network and Internet and select Advanced Network Settings at the bottom. Find the option for More Network Adapter Options and click on it. This will display all of your network adapters. Let's identify the mobile hotspot adapter that we just created. Next to it, it should say Microsoft Wi-Fi Direct Virtual Adapter. Remember that as we will need it for a later step. Next, find your ExpressVPN adapter, which should say ExpressVPN TAP adapter. Right-click on it, select Properties, and go to the Sharing tab. Check the first box that says Allow other network users to connect through this computer's internet connection. In the Home Networking Connection drop-down menu, select the mobile hotspot that we just created through the Windows settings. Then click OK. The final step is to connect to the VPN via the ExpressVPN app. Keep in mind that you need to use the OpenVPN UDP protocol, which you can switch to in the Options and Protocol settings. Connect to the VPN location of your choice, which will also set the VPN location for your created hotspot. Lastly, connect your gaming console to the newly created hotspot. Go to your console's network settings and select the hotspot you just created. And voila! You're now connected to a VPN on your gaming console using your Windows device. Once your gaming console is connected to the hotspot, it will use the same internet connection and IP address as your computer, which is connected to the internet through the VPN. This means that all traffic from your gaming console will be encrypted and routed through the VPN servers. You can test if the newly created connection is working by checking your IP address. Simply connect any wireless device to that new hotspot and go to our IP checker tool. Here you can check if your IP address has changed to the country you want. And that's it. You now know two different methods for using a VPN on your PlayStation. Whether you install a VPN on your router or share your VPN connection through a hotspot, you can enjoy a more private and secure gaming experience. If you need any help with installing a VPN on your router, check out the tutorial in the description below. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.